everyone it's Amy my dishwasher's running this is real life and this is a big haul we got this over a few visits um, yeah so I didn't want to bombard you with Dollar Tree hauls and I just didn't get around to doing it <laughs> <laughs> all right anyway found these little hot cold iPads I thought these were pretty interesting. Did we get more than one of these? Don't think so. And here but. I thought iPads were expensive. <laughs> yeah, they probably a buck. We should have got a bunch. Um, I picked up two of these, but I've only got one up here. One will go on the unicorn giveaway. I have not forgot about it. We are at like 20, 20, <laughs> 2,072, I think family members here on the channel so but I'm kind of like trying to hope things will not be so crazy yeah <laughs> so until then I'll just keep buying stuff but we will have that giveaway I have not forgotten anyway grab two of these these are super cute I only found one of these not just one kind just one and I've been looking for these so I was really happy um, Spa Naturals sulfate free chamomile bath salt. You can see little dried pieces of flowers in there. So I was happy to find that. Got two cans of SpaghettiOs. These are the really big cans. And neither one of us is crazy about SpaghettiOs. But it's another one of those stick in your pantry. You know. My grandmother used to I was have just going to say yeah. that. <laughs> Go ahead, tell me. It'll beat a snowball this winter. Yep. And we don't even get snow, so it would be. <laughs> <laughs> um, there's some Goya chicken bouillon. Grab two of those. Grab two of these barista blend almond milks. They are shelf stable. How do you milk an almond? You're more juice in almond than milk it. Oh, okay. It's nut juice. <laughs> nut milk. I don't know if nut milk or nut juice sounds better. They both sound kind of gross. 100% um, acetone. Maximum strength. Got one of the Chef Wardy throwback recipes. Lasagna, pasta, and tomato, and meat sauce says more meat more cheese more goodness and I don't think it has high fructose in it either so that's always a good thing I only got one to try I've bought their pop tarts before blah, 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 pop tarts before and like them I hadn't tried I bought the Oreo one and never got around to trying it but I bought it again well cookies and cream I've had the strawberry, love it. This is a bonus pack. The only flavor they had with the bonus pack was strawberry, right? Mm hmm And then cherry. And yes, I like my Pop-Tarts frost. Two packs of Raisinets. We both love Raisinets. Picked up several of these Friends trivia games. Ages 16 plus, 2 to 4 players. Knowledge of English required. I never saw that on a game before. But, okay. So, I got four of those. There's another one that I got. It was a different one. I don't know where it is, but... It's a Disney trivia one. Oh. Tony's looking right now. Anyway, got more of the GF Silk. Love that stuff. Found some of the Red Lobster Seafood Seasoning. Was happy to find this. There is the Disney Meme the Game. I only got one of those. And let's see. We got a couple of the grabbers. They break really easily, but. Especially if you fall with one in your hand. And, <laughs> yeah. Yeah. But they can be useful. 
got two things of Reese's Pieces. We love Reese's Pieces. Got Arizona Sweet Tea. No, it's not the best tea by a long shot. Um, banana chips. I'm getting confused about where I'm being. They have badminton birdies. These are like kind of light, but. And they have the badminton rack. So we'll see if these are okay or if, if you want to see us review any of this stuff, all you ever have to do is ask. So they did, the only thing they didn't have, they didn't have nets. You think they could have a cheap, like little, little, you know, <laughs> um, like during Halloween when they have the, you know, the tablecloth. You know what I'm talking about? Yeah. The creepy cloth? Yeah. So if they could do that, you think they could do a cheap net. Chocolate cream cakes. I haven't tried these. So I guess we'll see if those are any count. I saw Thrifty Tiffany take these and one of the shelf brackets they have and make hanging fruit baskets. So that's what we're going to do with these. I have some of the shelf brackets somewhere. Hopefully. I wasn't a, we wasn't able to find them at the Dollar Tree. Yeah, um, garden stuff is pretty much, you know, it goes quick. Okay. So I showed you the red lobster. Oh, we got two of those. Yeah, I didn't realize we did. Well, that's okay. We love shrimp. <laughs> yeah. So, got a lemon pepper. I can't remember if I had one of these or not. Caribbean citrus with a kick. And then the garlic and herbs, rustic Tuscan style. Got some of the stick ups. Got orange, or well, they're sparkling citrus. They smell really good. They do have a smell to them. <laughs> I got some of my maple nut goodies. I was really excited when I found this. It's um, I suddenly forgot how to say that. Martinelli's. Duh. You know, I've been drinking their sparkling apple juice for years. It's always something I like to get at New Year's Eve. But this is, it says rosé. And I looked closer and it is apple raspberry. Mm -hmm. Where's it at? I'm trying to find it. It's right there. Oh, okay. So... I am really excited to try this. I probably should have got every one they had. No, I don't drink pop anymore. I still have my sparkling juices. Pasta sides, creamy Alfredo penne. Um, probably should have got more than one of these. This is going to be a great item to keep in the pantry. And it's good till August. I'm telling you all, this is it's going to be a long one. How much? Where are we at? 8, 42, 43. Um, paper towel holder, but Thrifty Tiffany showed putting toilet paper rolls on it. You could do that. I don't think the um, the masking paper I got that Commonwealth Picker discussed using in your shipping supplies, I don't think it's going to fit on there. So we'll use it for toilet paper. We can try and see and if it does get another one. Um, got some Brim's cheese balls. I couldn't remember if those are good or not. I like some of Brim's stuff. And another box of the chicken crackers. They, these are so good. They're not exactly chicken biscuit crackers, but they're a dollar where those are like four dollars. <laughs> so, <laughs> they're close enough. Yeah. All right, puzzles. We've got Minnie Mouse. We've got Donald Duck. We got two of these Toy Story. We got Cinderella. I'm having a ball. <laughs> That's funny. 
we got two of the bibbidi bobbidi boo and the last one is this one i don't know if i'll get rid of this one or not this one is just all the different princesses this one's gonna be challenging actually i think i could be wrong they're all 500 pieces this was really cool i just happened to find it it was just like buried in there was a box this buried and i was like hey that's slimer and it's ectoplasm how cool is that so i just thought that was fun that's a couple things of hydrogen peroxide because i accidentally spilled a whole bottle of it the other day <laughs> so i figured i'd get some more tony got you got a few of these didn't you oh uh, there was like two different ones so i got both of them yeah, and you can see these on his channel, Tony's Brick House. Be sure to go check him out. He's awesome. <laughs> Shameless plug. <laughs> so he got a couple of those, and he's he also got these. Um, these would be great in Halloween builds. These transparent. This, and you got red. Yeah. Or not orange. Sorry. Yeah. Yeah, these would be great in Halloween builds, especially if you had something that reflected light, and I mean some sort of light source. got this magnet for a friend be as strong as your espresso got a food tent I couldn't remember if these are good or not what's I, a food tent you use it outside like put it over your dish of food to keep bugs out oh, yeah. the screen okay got measuring tape I think we got a couple of these. I thought I got two of them, but I don't know where the other one this is one right it's now. It's magnetic. Hmm. I'm not sure what that means, but. But I, yeah, I mean, for a dollar, I always like to have a couple handy ones around. Yeah, I use one all the time when I'm listing stuff. And I have one for when I ship, and I had one in a basement, and I broke it, so this is going to go to the basement. We got in on the tail end of the movies. I, mean, I just happened to look down I'm like oh there's some movies up under that show <laughs> so the Lone Ranger who was that masked man I remember the original of course, TV series eight episodes yeah of course they were reruns but I remember <laughs> them as a kid so I did enjoy them I remember them as a kid too I don't remember liking them that much <laughs> but it beat some of the other crap that was on TV because <laughs> when we were little we didn't have a lot of channels a semi-definitive list of worst nightmares. I thought this sounded good. You can't beat books for a dollar. Your ultimate guide to style. Tips and tricks and ideas for getting your best look ever. Child's Play. Mona <laughs> Montessori, I think that's how you say it. Games and activities for your baby and toddler. Did we just get three of these, or did you just put three up here? Uh, I think there might be a couple more. Okay, were they different? Uh, I don't think so. There's two unicorns. Yeah, I think they might have been. Two unicorns, and I think the, and that's a koala back there. Yeah. And then, I th did we get a couple of these? Yeah. Lock stars. I just got this one because it's a vampire, you know? It's super cute. And vampires are probably going to start to come back into fashion because, you know, the next Twilight book is coming out in August. Okay, we got a bunch of these. They're so cute. It has a Cheerio in its head. <laughs> That's what it looks like. Um, ooh, transform. What does it transform into? I don't know. Anyway, I bought several of these. Oh, that, that ice cream cone looking one. Got the pineapple fish. How cute is that? <laughs> does it say at the top? Reveal three secret charms. Ooh. And then we got this little dude. And strawberry. And these are so satisfying. <laughs> and is this all the ones we got? Yes. And we got the little gummy bear looking one. So, oh, I got another book. What on y'all? So 
other one was 365 days of creative play. So it was normally $16.99. And that's it. I think. Well, we also got some bread, but you guys are used to that. Yeah, we get bread. We got some hot dog buns. I got a broom, but... If they've I, been with the channel for a while, they can... It'd be like, yeah. yeah, I know. You got some butter bread, you got some 100% wheat bread, and yeah. you got some artisan bread. <laughs> yeah, I got uh, I got a broom, but I've been using it, and I got a sponge mop. Yep. Didn't figure you'd really want to see it. And there was nothing different in those bags. No. Just duplicates. Yeah. I think we might have some more of those. But I'm not sure. Oh yeah, we do. We have a couple other different ones. Got this guy. And if you're wondering, yes, some of this stuff is resale. And if it doesn't resale, it makes awesome friend mail for some of my little family members here on the channel. Alright. That is it. Oh, I want to ask y'all something. Oh, and another squishy. No, I think we already had yeah, that one. I think one you already had that one. Okay, sorry, guys. And this one. Kind of raspberry bear thing. Yeah. They just make me hungry. Has anybody tried these? So yeah, I bought a bunch of them, just kind of glanced at them, you know, for different kind of dark spots. And, uh... Cause I, I, you know, I know it's okay to buy like the Sunbeam stuff from there, but I've heard that some of the Dollar Tree, you know, branded electronics can be kind of iffy. And I don't want to burn the house down. <laughs> so if you use those and not burned your house down. <laughs> well, actually, if you've used those and almost burned your house down. Let me know. <laughs> we'll probably plug one up. Plug, la, la, la. plug one up upstairs, just to see how it does. And keep an eye on it. But that's it. I'm gonna pop this in the fridge. I can't wait to try it. It's gonna be so good. Check me out on Instagram. The link's down below. You know, I might put some reviews over there. If there's anything you want to know about, just ask. Yeah. Hope y'all are staying safe. Be sure to like, comment, share, subscribe. Hit that bell so you never miss a video. And we'll see you next time. Bye. Bye.